Hello, hi guys, it's Inam here with Android 6.0 Marshmallow on the Galaxy S6 versus Android 5.11 Lollipop on the S6 Edge. And we're going to see if there's any major improvements to memory management. So here we go, flat on my desk makes it a little bit easier. Now just to show you, I've got nothing running in the recent apps here. And just to show you that I'm not lying, I'm going to go into about device here. And you can see Android 5.11 lollipop on the s6 edge here and on the s6 we've got the marshmallow beta android 6.0 so we're gonna load up a bunch of apps here see how they react in terms of memory management we know the s6 generally had uh, some issues with memory leaks and whatnot particularly chrome chrome was a, a very big issue that i noticed myself where it would just drop in the background somewhere um, so Samsung running some very, I'm going to say not efficient, but hard uh, memory management in the background there. So we've got, uh, well, we've got so far, we've got Instagram, Google settings. Uh, okay. So let's come out of that. That's not a bad case to be fair. Let's load up the camera. So we've got the camera on both there as well. And we'll do Twitter get that loaded up on both come out of that and while we're here I can see need for speed no limits did that go through is there a slight delay on both of these marshmallow variant went in a little bit faster maybe or is it just me so that's loading up contents already downloaded we're all connected up to the same Wi-Fi access point so Asphalt 8, pretty quick on both devices. Again, contents already downloaded. So there we go, that looks cool. We'll come out of that. And what else do we have here? So we'll go to Grand Theft Auto, San Andreas. Again, shouldn't take too long to get into the flow here both devices running very similar which is what you'd expect okay so we've got san andreas we got need for speed let's try a bit of asphalt 8 oh no we did asphalt 8 already okay so can't remember what i've done so what we'll do is we'll let's see what we got also here imdb get that on both awesome come out of that uh Let's see TripAdvisor, get that going on both. Uh, skip that stuff, we'll come out of that, come out of that. And what we'll do, we'll go into, let's see some of the media apps I've got. So, Showcase UK, da -da -da -da, loading up, deny, come out of that. Okay, so that's going in the background there. We'll get a speed test app open as well. So we're just opening up a bunch of apps here uh, and then we're going to see what happens. So we'll do Sam Mobile, if I can even see the other one, there we go. So let's see so far, pretty fluid across both. Lollipop seems to be a bit more snappy to be fair. Marshmallow seems to be a little bit more animated, I'd say. Now, before we have a look at the memory management, notice we have a GIF GAF Google Chrome being the third one. Yes, it was on both, so just couldn't see it on the Marshmallow. It re-renders it when you go back in, which is a bit of a bugbearer compared to iOS. So let's come out of this and see if I can go to Samsung Smart Manager on the S6 and see if we can find the same thing on the regular S6 along the left hand side sorry I loaded that on the right hand side on the S6 edge so uh, Galaxy Manager if I can actually spot it there we go Smart Manager so as you can see 86% RAM used on the S6 Edge, 383 megabytes free, 
whilst on the marshmallow variant of the S6 you've got 82% free with 490 megabytes free that it's saying so we're gonna just come out of this and see if we can load up some more apps even so um, let's see what else we've got on here well they haven't actually loaded up as yet so let's see what else we've got so we've done Star Wars I've done screw fix uh, remind me later I don't want to tell you right now so let's come out of that screw fix get that loaded up as well come out of that blah 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 I think that's pretty much it to be fair let's load up YouTube because we're on YouTube obviously so let's go back where is it if I can even find it got it that loaded up excellent okay see what else we've got here uh, let's see Google Maps I'd have to find it on the S6 Edge here running Lollipop. So let's get that going. No thanks, download the home area, we'll come out of that. Okay, so let's have a, another wander through the recent open apps. Marshmallow seems more animated, doesn't seem quite as snappy as Lollipop now, does it? Which is uh, a little bit weird depends what you were expecting to be honest I was expecting it to be a little bit more snappy so let's go back and see if we can load the smart manager uh, if we where did we put it there it goes so so still saying 80% 82% used on the s6 edge running lollipop but 77% used on the marshmallow android 6.0 beta so it's saying 619 megabytes free but 419 megabytes free on the lollipop so marshmallow on the face of it saying it's more efficient but i wonder how it actually is so we'll come out go to youtube it's okay let's go back to gif gaff here does it re-render? If it did, it was so quick I didn't see it. But that was okay. Let's head back into a game that we started up earlier. Um, let's see what we have. GTA San Andreas. That's always a good one. So it starts the game up again, which I really hate. So still there, technically although it restarts it back up again which is, is a pain so let's just turn around let's get you going have I got the screen on rotate I didn't know I had okay so let's come out of there keep on going uh, let's try asphalt 8 can I remember where I put it I like the way the apps have to completely reload compared to iOS variants of it so what we'll do we'll load up we'll clear all these out allegedly there we go and then we get into the Samsung smart manager if I can find it on this one because I don't have it organized so where are we there we go so notice that all the apps are closed because we got rid of them. The Lollipop variant says 73% used, 741 megabytes free. Marshmallow Android 6.0 Beta says 66% used with 915 megabytes free. So on the face of it, Marshmallow does seem like its memory management is better than Lollipop. So again, the apps tend to reload in the background. So as you can see there, we're gonna do end all, end all. Cleaning out RAM seems so harsh. So 315 megabytes have been cleared. So look at that. 
61% memory used, 62 used on the S6 Lollipop variant, 71% with 791 megabytes free, with one gigabyte free on the Android 6.0 marshmallow variant so there we go guys that was a memory management comparison between android 6.0 marshmallow beta on the s6 versus android 5.11 lollipop on the s6 edge certainly it seems on the face of it that memory management has been improved with this beta update but do let me know in the comment section down below i personally don't like the way chrome has to re-render compared to some ios applications which when you switch back to they're just there uh, as well as some of the others where they completely have to reload. But as I say, do let me know in the comments section down below what you think. As ever, any comments or questions you guys have got, hit them up in the comments section down below. Please like, subscribe and tag along on social media at Inamka4. Thanks for watching, have a wicked day and I'll see you next time.